guys, today's video is going to be the requested easy beachy wave hair tutorial. I'm actually on my way out and I thought it'd be perfect for me to do it for you guys. Uh, it sounds very echoey um, and that's because I'm in my bathroom. I don't know why bathrooms always sound so echoey. It's so weird. But anyway, um, as you guys can tell, this is this is my hair at its natural state. All I did was I blow I all I did was blow dry it. Um, and if you guys want to see how I blow dry my hair, which I don't think you do, because I all I really honestly do is just put the blow dryer up this way so that all the hair can be when when the wind is blowing, it's going against the hair rather than blowing it like this because then I end up like a little lion with like huge frizzy hair. After I blow dry my hair, you guys can see a little bit of wave in it. I braid my hair. I do a side braid, like something like this, and I just braid my hair very easily. Um, and then the following day, once my the oils in my hair kind of sink into, or the oils in my head kind of sink into my hair, is when I do my hair. Um, if you do like notice when your hair is a little dirty, it's like your best friend. Like it, it, it's easier for it to curl. It's easier for like for you to like do styles on it. I don't know why, but I think it's the oils in your head that kind of makes it easier for your hair. Like your hair looks better when it's dirty. That's just my opinion. But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'm using my Remington um, wand. I don't know the exact name of this because I bought it um, a few months back. I think I bought it in October, but they should still have it at um, uh, Target. But it's already been heating for like 10 minutes, maybe less, and that's all it really needs. As I, I told you guys, you can never burn yourself. Like I'm holding this and it's not hot at all. So what I'm gonna do is um, I'm gonna grab my hair and I'm just gonna part it like this. And then I'm just gonna wrap or do like a little bun. And then with like one of these little clips or whatever type of clip you have, you could just snap your hair or hold your hair up. And then I split my hair in two sections. Um, and then I grab, I like to grab thick strands, here maybe you guys can see it better on this side. I like to grab thick strands of hair like this because the thicker it is, the the um, the better the wave will look. So if you grab a strand like this, you're going to get a very tight, almost like a curl rather than a wave. So I'm going to grab a strand about this thick. And then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wrap it like this. And you're really just going to follow the gaps in between the the um, the wand. You're going to hold it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And then you're going to let it go. And then you get this really pretty, like, fabulous wave. And then you're just going to repeat the steps. And again, you're going to hold it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. And then you let it go. And like that. So then I'm going to keep doing that throughout my whole head. And this literally takes me, I kid you guys, like I'm not even kidding, it takes me five minutes. And it doesn't matter that your hair, see how my hair is like right now, it has like a wave in it, or if your hair, um, it doesn't really matter because once you, once you do the, um, the wave in it, it doesn't even matter what the texture of your hair was prior because, um, the wand will just kind of, the wave still creates, which is awesome. Because you don't have to worry about blow drying your hair straight or like straightening it and then doing this. Like you could just go straight. You could just go straight from like the, sh the shower, blow dry, and then do this. So you guys can tell it's really, really easy. So I'm just going to finish the rest of my hair and show you guys the end result and how I brush it out and add um, what, what I add to my hair.
my hair and this is what it looks like. This is the finished product. Um, sometimes you'll notice that the ends look a little weird. So what you, all you have to do is just grab an end and then just kind of wrap it around um, whatever little section. Let me see, like this. And then you, okay, why is this not doing it? Uh, like this. So you just wrap it and you kind of hold it just to curl in the end. Um, that's if you see that your ends look funky. So after I do this, I'm going to comb my fingers through my hair like so because I don't like, I like it to look kind of like a tussled wave, kind of like I, like I just woke up and I had these like fabulous waves in my hair. Um, I don't like for them to look so tight. So then you just kind of brush it with your fingers or you can brush it with a, a comb or whatever you like. And then after that, see it gives you like this really pretty volume. After that, I grab a little bit of my Moroccan oil, which is, um, this Moroccan oil, I actually bought it at a hair salon where my cousin used to work, and I think I paid like $16 for this tiny little bottle, which is a lot of money for the amount, but it lasts you a long time. Um, so you just grab very, very little bit, like that much, I don't know if you guys can see it, but you grab that much, and then you just rub it on your hands, and then you just run it through your hair, and this is going to give you like a really sleek finish. Um, and if you have any frizz, it's going to control the frizz, and it's going to give you like a nice shine, but not like to where it looks oily. I love Moroccan oil, like I can never do my hair without it. And then if you want to add a little bit of volume, which I probably will, but I didn't bring my um, teasing comb, you can just grab pieces like this, and then just uh, tease at the top, at the root, and then you have nice big waves and volume. Um, and that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this very quick, very easy uh, hair tutorial using the Remington wand. Again, you can find this at Target. Um, and I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys subscribe. Share this video with your friends if you like. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram at Style by Ale, Facebook fan page. Everything will be linked down below. I hope you guys have a fabulous day, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!